perfect childhood, didn't I? <laughs> was raised in a perfect godly home where we, you were taught godly things, godly attitudes, taught to raise a godly life. If any of you were like me, I was not raised mm -hmm. like that. And because of that, um, patterns in my life and attitudes in my life were set up that, that were very contrary to what God's will is for my life and what he has for me. And Pam and I just recently went through life's journey together with Pam Harrison. Pam's not here this morning, so we told him we'd speak for him. And it was a wonderful time um, of sharing. It was the first time I had ever felt loved enough to really just open up and share some things and experiences that I had. I felt very, very safe. And I wish Tim was here this morning so I could tell him thank you. It was the first time that I felt safe enough in 53 years to speak about some things that I needed to deal with. And it is a wonderful, wonderful time. Um, and I would urge any of you, if you have things in your life that you feel like um, <coughs> is a battle, um, attitudes, thought processes, sins that you need to deal with, it's keeping you from being everything that God mm -hmm. wants you to be. I would urge you to take time and experience this. It, it was wonderful. Uh, the grace of the Lord is building up on Highway 5, uh, where Tim is ministering now. Uh, it's the ultimate journey, and it's the dates for March are this. Three Mondays, the 12th, the 19th, and the 26th. It's from 8.30 to 5. Uh, three Mondays, and then from three consecutive days, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, 